Um, I, me, myself, and I, I did this all on my own. Um, and I will be showing you uh, a permaculture farm that I designed out of Lego blocks. And so let's get down to it. Um, here is my home, right here. Um, it has a basement. I did a two-story house. And I keep all my cheese and milk. And during tornadoes, you kind of want a basement. And uh, right back here, I have my kitchen garden where I have my greenhouse and my kitchen um, food. <laughs> and right here on top, I have my solar panels right there. And um, right back here is my hogs, and they kind of plow up my ground so I can plant all my plants. And right here, I have my garage where I store all my stuff. And here's the kitchen uh, coop where I run my chickens in at night. And right here is my chickens my sheep and my cows, and it's all in a line. And right here, I have my windmill that uses my water and my energy. Oh. And right here, I have my um, kind of like a little, like, what do you call those again? I get those... Um, cup like swales? Little, yeah, cup swales. And right here, I have my barn. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, mistake. <laughs> right here, I have my hay loft where I shoot down my um, all my hay to my animals is when it's bad storms. And right here, I have my um, my horse and my like buggy you could say so I can plow my ground. I don't have to lose like a bulldozer or anything like that. And here's my swells. I plant all my lettuce and tomatoes and stuff like that. <laughs> Here's my um, forest garden where I get all my apples and my pears and my peaches and all that good stuff. <laughs> and here is my berries where I keep all my strawberries, my raspberries, and all that. So that's basically it. That's excellent. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Any questions? Um, so I'm wondering why, again, um, why you chose this order for your animals. If there's any reason, um, I, I, and also why you put, you why you put your chickens here. I understand that you're gonna run them into their coop, right? But why did you put your hogs there? Well, I put my hogs there, so because I'm doing my all oh, my like close by like um, food for my um, um, my kitchen. And when I run out of that, I of course do that. And right here, so the hogs were at least to be here, and there was no garden. And they kind of plowed up my can and renewed it, and so it's all healthy soil, mm. nice top soil. So I plant that there. So the, yeah, the pins are movable. So maybe they're they're yeah. mealing up that yeah. soil now, and then mm -hmm. you can move them to maybe some yeah. meal up some other soil. Okay. Okay. Thank you. And can it be quiet with your animals following each other like we do at home? Um, like we always have the cattle. And, uh, because uh, cows. Cows eat the long grass, and they, of course, you know, poop a lot. <laughs> and then the sheep eat it down to the ground, and they, of course, will get parasites. But the chickens are there after them to eat that parasite, so the sheep don't get sick. Mm. Very good. That's good. Nice. <laughs> Any more questions? I just have a comment. I wanted to say that I love the fact that you're plowing with horses. Oh, thank you. Yes, that's a great idea. What gave you that idea instead of using tractors? Well, tractors lose oil and that um, clutes the ground. Mm -hmm. And so if you use horses and uh, plow, it, you know, more healthier for the soil. Good job. Mm -hmm. Any more questions? I have one. Okay. So you keep the horses in the, the barn then? No, um, yeah, I keep the horses in the barn. They're, they're not like the other animals. I keep them in the barn, but they mostly like eat out in pasture. And um, you're going to rotate these animals then around? Mm -hmm. Um, And then are you going to re replant, or is it you just going to let it come back naturally and move them? And what kind of rotation system actually, do you have? Um, actually, um, that used to be like that. Oh, that, okay. So that, they kind of renew it. They kind of renew it and make it uh Great. Yep. So what's your wife's name that lives in this house with you? I don't know. Um, Kate. Kate. He's a do-it-yourself. It's Kate. It's Kate. 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 Kate.
So were you happy, Tim? Were you like living here? Is it a good life? I actually, I would, if this was real life, I would love to live here. Yay. Mm -hmm. Um, you? So is that a key line, Paul? Uh, yes, that's a key line. Any more questions? Mm -hmm. yeah. So I imagine that your farm is pretty productive. Mm -hmm. What do you do with your extra food? That's do you eat it or um, do you store it? I am um, thinking about that. I would like sell it to probably make money. Oh, if I had enough money and I was like, tired, I'd probably like give it out free to poor and hungry people. Yeah. Any more questions? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I guess that's yeah. it. Well, <laughs>